15,000 patients in the country are waiting for an organ transplant. Hardly any of those would expect to get one from an acquaintance. But as Fox 13's Dora Scheidel shows us, that's exactly what happened at Intermountain Medical Center. You're going to die. That's what he told me. A doctor told Jason Anderson that he had end-stage kidney failure 18 years ago when he was just 30 years old. He spent that time spending six hours a day on dialysis while his wife and three kids struggled to imagine a future without him. Being depressed, sad, sick, what our plan was. Monica works at Intermountain Home Care in Ogden, and last January, her colleague Kingsley Teo overheard her talking to Jason on the phone about recent test results. Just started asking questions about the whole kidney transplant process. Kingsley quickly realized they had the same blood type. I used to donate blood in high school to get out of class all the time. So, <laughs> <laughs> And after discussing it with his wife, he decided to commit to six months worth of testing. It was amazing just that Anybody would want to do that, let alone a co-worker. Kingsley passed every test and ended up being the perfect match for Jason. I knew him, um, but my concern was, was he aware of what he's getting into? Was he aware of what the commitment was? Are you going somewhere special? Two weeks ago, Kingsley donated one of his kidneys to Jason. Give me a hug, dude. All right. Thank you. Yeah, absolutely. See you on the other side. I called him my personal Jesus. <laughs> That, to me, he's my savior. With the simple hope that someday, someone may pay it forward. In the future, if something happened to one of my family members, uh, one of my children, that someone would step forward. Are you ready? Thanks. Since the surgery two weeks ago, both Jason and Kingsley are feeling great. Jason says he hasn't felt this good in 30 years. And you may have noticed, Kingsley has a br pretty good sense of humor, and that may have come from his dad, Fox 13's own Big Buddha. Reporting in studio, Dora Scheidel, Fox 13 News, Utah.